<laughs> anyway, nobody wants to be out in this cold. But some of us have to brave this record breaker. Local 12's Angela Ingram is in over the Rhine right now with two sides of that story. Angela? Rob, we always see people working outside, first responders such as firefighters, police officers, Duke Energy workers, and also people who work as valet parking attendants. But we caught up with some people today who are making sure that they stay safe during these very cold temperatures. Drivers are taking advantage of breaks between snowstorms, cleaning the dirt and salt off their cars. At Johnny's Car Wash in Anderson Township, customers can get the full service treatment and workers will thoroughly clean the inside and outside of their vehicles. There's not many full service car washes left around town, so generally, you know, with the vacuuming of the car, um, then our employee rides through the car wash inside of the car and then they're outside drying it off anywhere from three to five minutes. Workers are wearing multiple layers of clothing and there are other ways to protect themselves from the elements while still giving quality service. We have heated break room where they can sit and wait for the customer to pull in. They have access to seeing the customer so you know, we can accommodate the customer while staying warm pretty much at the same time. It's one thing to work out in the cold or to be out for a short period of time, but it's quite another to have no home during this harsh weather. The drop-in center is asking for emergency financial help to care for the homeless during this cold snap. We encourage people who are sleeping on the streets to come in. The shelter has a policy of never turning anyone away, and workers say the demand is even greater during severe weather. We have 222 beds, but in the winter we expand that and we um, operate a, an overflow capacity called the winter shelter. So on top of that, we can serve about close to 400 people a night. And the drop-in center is still taking those donations online and also here downtown in Over the Rhine. Reporting live, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. Rob, back to you. Angela, thanks very much. The morning crew will have the most up-to-date list of closings and delays, and there are many tomorrow. John Gum will have the latest look at the bitter cold and the latest on the next round of snow Tim's talking about. Good morning, Cincinnati starts at 425.